Hello, everyone. This is Coach Martha from Inspire Weight Loss Davy, and today we are here with Debbie. Hi, Debbie. Hi, Hi Coach Martha. Hi. <laughs> Debbie is a client of Inspire Weight Loss uh, Davy, and so gracious to come here and share her story with you, and hopefully we can inspire you and inspire forward. Just a little information about Inspire Forward. Inspire Forward started out of my own personal story where I started my journey. I lost uh, my weight and I felt so great that I wanted to inspire forward. I wanted to pay it forward. And so um, I said, you know what, with all the clients that go through our doors, I want to also create a platform where our clients can inspire forward as well. So here we are. <laughs> so Debbie. And I'm happy to be here. <laughs> yeah, thank you so much. So Debbie, tell me, tell the world about you. Tell us a little bit about you. Tell us what brought you to Inspire. Okay. Um, well, I was getting a little bit older and um, maybe a lot older. <laughs> and then um, uh, the pandemic happened. And I think like a lot of people, my life changed, um, situations changed. I had recently become an empty nester. My kids had moved away from home. Um, I was used to teaching children's ministry and having Girl Scouts and Boy Scouts and just a lot of activities outside of school with my family and with work. And all of a sudden I was working from home um, for two years. Uh, I had previous, you know, um, health conditions that I needed to be careful about. I was very concerned about um, catching COVID and, you know, um, while this pandemic was going on. And mm -hmm. so I was working from home and um, I didn't feel, you know, happy and inspired at that time. I was happy to be working and grateful for that, but I was putting on the pounds as well. And I needed to do something to really inspire myself. <laughs> um, I found uh, Inspire through an ad and I decided to try it after talking with my family and praying about it and, you know, just seeing if maybe this would be something for me. And I walked in and I met Coach Martha and I felt really good. I felt uplifted. It wasn't so much about everything then about just quickly losing the weight. It was how comfortable I spent, you mm -hmm. know, I felt meeting you and talking with you and, um, you know, starting my journey that way. And I started with the program and I, I'm just amazed. I think my family's amazed. They've been very supportive. Um, you know, and, and I've been telling everybody, okay, this is working. This is working. <laughs> I love that. And, I um, remember, I remember when you became an empty nester. Yes, I, I didn't do very well with that. I'm um, very close I to my kids. That. And I, I was really sad that they were, you know, I'm happy that they were doing well and they were moving on, but it's, it certainly was a change for me and not being able to be as active as I'm used to being. Um, that felt a little overwhelming. And I think I ate a little mm -hmm. more Cheetos than I should have, and maybe a little <laughs> more Snicker bars. <laughs> You're not um, the only one. I remember but, also that you, your activity level was high. You're a runner. Yes, yes. A runner. Prior to um, all of that, I, I enjoyed running. Mm -hmm. um, and, you know, I enjoyed Zumba, Zumba, exercising, doing a lot of things, but everything basically stopped. Um, and yeah. So you saw our ad. That was yeah. the first step you took because a lot of times um, people are weirded out by these ads because there's so many that you see to, in social media and then you're not really sure if it's legit or not. <laughs> you know, and not only that, it's I mean, it, it really is scary out there. You you know, you have to be comfortable mm -hmm. when you meet someone and and be able to trust not only the product, but the individuals that are giving you the information. So um, there's just so much out there that you really have to, um, you know, do your due diligence and, and do some investigation. And, and um, you know, like I said, it was not just the comfort factor, but you had all the information and the, um, you were concerned, not just about the weight loss, but looking at my health and understanding right. my history. And, you know, um, I was communicating with a nurse on staff and there was just so many things going on that, you know, helped in the process um, to get me where I am right now. You're so awesome. Um, you are so diligent. 
you know, you're on top of it. You're so, you know, you, you really take control of um, your journey and what you need to do and stay on task and be focused. And that is what, that's, that's really one of the things that makes people successful, you know, in any program, really. Um, and it was, it was time for you to put yourself first and take care of you and put yourself back into a place that um, you wanted to go back to run. You yeah. wanted to go yeah. back to do these things that brings joy yeah. to your heart. And that was one of your wives, you know, besides the health part, of course, you know, but you wanted to get back to that lifestyle um, that I can totally understand because I love <laughs> anything fitness. If anybody knows me, uh, I love running as well. Uh, so I, I, I understand that. And I'm so glad that you found us. Now, I have here your, your information. So as of today, you've lost 36 pounds yes. and 30 plus inches. <laughs> yes, yes. Can you and share? what's interesting is, you know, just, you know, at the start of the summer, I said, okay, you know, I'm really going to focus on trying to get this weight off. And, and, and like you said, it's following the program, you know, because it really is paying attention to the steps, you know, and it's not that difficult, you know, if you actually just look at what you can and cannot eat. And, and it's basically just being aware of what you're putting in your body. You know, it's, it's not so much that you're denying yourself because I eat everything. It's just basically that I'm looking at my proportions and, you know, just looking at the times that I'm eating different things. And um, mm -hmm. I've been able to see a change. It's a lifestyle mm -hmm. change. Absolutely. And, you know, we are what we eat. It's just the truth. You yes. know, that saying mm -hmm. it is, you know, our input is our output. Our body responds to everything that goes into our mouth, everything that we, we introduce our bodies to that we intake um, and so that's one of the important parts of what we do here at Inspire is that our program is a lifestyle program. And we want to use just regular food that you will buy in the grocery store because then you can continue doing that. And so like when you're now that you're you're practically done with the with your round with the program, you have all of these things that you can continue to do. All the tools are there. You know, yes. all the tools and tips and you're a teacher, you know what's up. <laughs> yeah. Can you just share with everybody like, what are your takeaways? Like, what are things that you've learned? The aha moments, anything that you can share with the world um, that you experienced that you learned throughout the journey? You know, I think it's just about being positive and understanding that um, it is possible. You know, I, I know that I wanted to lose the weight. I found someone to help me do it. Thank you so much, Coach Martha. And I have to give a shout out to Coach Kimmy um, <laughs> because she's been so supportive as well. Um, but just it, it's nutrition, you know, I was eating and I was eating unhealthy before and I was not getting enough activity. And, you know, so what I learned, I think was a happy balance, you know, learning to basically, and I'm going to get this off my computer, just learning to basically, you know, eat healthier, um, eat the right portions of food, incorporating exercise. And I think the takeaway is understanding that you have to, you know, trust a little bit, go out there and have a little bit of faith and, and try something. Because if you change nothing, nothing is going to change. And I realized that I was not going to be able to do this on my own um, because I wasn't sure where to start. And so going to someplace like Inspire, um, it, it's more than the name. It's, it, you know, not only was it inspiring because I had somebody to talk with and to monitor the weight loss and to monitor what I was eating, to give me a booklet that I can follow. It's a guide and it is a lifestyle change because it's regular food. It's things that I buy and I prepare, you know, I get from the grocery store. It's food that I give my family, but overall we're eating healthier you know, we're just living a healthier lifestyle. Yeah. So I guess the takeaway is to go out there and change something. If you would want yeah. to see a change in your life is to, you know, go out there and take a chance and go and investigate, you know, try <laughs> inspire because it truly has made a difference in my life. That's so true. You know, um, go out and investigate if, and if you can't change anything, if you're not, you don't go out and make a change you know, take action. Um, and that's the truth for anything, whether it's weight loss, whether it's anything, any aspect of our lives, if there's certain areas of our lives that we're just not happy with, 
you know, that we know that we, we need to improve. Um, the only one that can take that step is you. Yeah. I, I want the only one that can take that step for me. And, and Debbie, you are the only one that can take that step for you, you know? So while you're talking, the word that comes to mind is awareness. Like when, while you yeah. were going through the program, it just brought you aware of how to manage these things um, that, it, and how to also create these habits you know, so then you can just continue. We love our clients at Inspire, but we don't want to see you forever. <laughs> we only want to see you to say hi and give you a hug, you know, and cheer you on, but not because you've gained it back, <laughs> you exactly. know, and you know, exactly. and life happens too, you know, life happens too. And, and we have clients that come and they do quick slim outs and just to kind of like do a little reset um, because, you know, sometimes we go to cruises <laughs> yes. and vacations but and the, for the most part you know what we hope for everybody is that it is a life change transformation that yes. it it just redirects a trajectory of somebody's life instead of going the unhealthy route let's let's take a u-turn and go the healthy route that's what we hope you know debbie i am so happy for you <laughs> Thank you. I am super I'm excited. So I think my family's excited. Um, what's interesting is that, you know, I, as I said, I had pre-existing uh, medical conditions. So I'm constantly in contact with my doctors and they're amazed. You know, they're absolutely amazed. You're like, well, we've been telling you to do this and do this. And I go, yeah, but this is what's working now. <laughs> so it's I really nice that. and everybody's on board. Um, you know, just to share a little bit, it, I was on blood pressure medication and, and heart medication, just so many other things. And as I've become a little bit healthier, a little bit slimmer, you know, the number of medications that I need to take has also gone down. And so that's inspiring for me. Um, it's just a win-win situation. It's a very positive environment. And I would really, really encourage people to check it out. It's the best kept secret in Davy. <laughs> You so know you've what? got to check it out. I love that. It's not just what you see in the mirror, but what you don't see. The yeah. internal changes yes. that comes with losing the fat. And we call it weight loss because that's what people understand. But really, it's fat loss. And when you lose the fat, um, the, the changes that happen within our bodies to the positive just like yeah. what you said, you know, you've been yeah. able to minimize meds. That is amazing. That is, that perfect. is amazing. That is awesome. It is. So and good. I will tell you just one more quick thing. Um, I was never a fan of just drinking a lot of water. I know how healthy it is. And I, I mean, I would tell my kids, drink your water, you know, you need to hydrate. But it was always something I had a problem doing as a teacher. It's like, I think we tend not to drink as much water mm -hmm. because then you have to leave and go to the bathroom and, you know, you have to find coverage for your kids or whatever. So we just don't drink as much as we possibly should. And I think one of the things that this program has taught me is just how important it is to actually mm -hmm. really hydrate. And so by drinking more, I mean, it's like, it's amazing. You know, everything changes in your body when you have the amount, right oh amount of God. water. It sounds like something simple, but it really is so important. So, so there's so many good. positive things that um, mm -hmm. I'm incorporating that I was not incorporating before I love that I love that and water is life it really is for our bodies water is life oh I'm so happy for you Debbie keep it thank going you. thank you keep thank it you going. so much I'm so happy. thank you for taking the time to share with me and share with everybody your story um I'm You're so welcome. happy for you I am so happy for you. Thank you so much. And for all of you guys that are watching, thank you for tuning in. There's more yes. to come. The best is yet to come. Come, yes. Right? <laughs> yes, yes, most definitely. So, so if you need that support, um, if you need guidance, you don't have to do it on your own. I have my story. Debbie has her story. I took a long time to figure out or, or to get myself in a place that I felt comfortable going somewhere to, to seek help. And my my setback was more pride than anything to be honest that's my story I was prideful like to let somebody know that I needed help that's my story um, and so if you feel like you don't know where to go um, or if you feel like um, like maybe you you don't you shouldn't put yourself first if you feel if you feel like um, you can do this 
on your own and you have been and you just don't see the results, come see us. Come yeah. see us because there's a lot of people out there. Weight gain doesn't only mean that you're stuffing your face with food. Weight gain can mean so many things, so many different things that don't even have anything to do with food. For me, it was part emotional. Food. Yeah. Yeah. Part, part emotional. of it was emotional. My kids going away. <laughs> I remember. You know, so if you're not really sure and you're doing all the right things and all these other things, just come see us. Our consultations are free. It is no pressure. No pressure. So we'll put our information in the comments. Come see us, free consultation. Thank you, Debbie, again. You're very welcome. Thank very you. welcome. Thank you week, so much.